on Stu Crew. Oh, there she is. The one and only. Who? Carlin. Oh. <laughs> My wife. Boutique co owner. Cool. cool. How you feeling day, this go. morning? Good, I'm ready to get started. I'm coming to get you. I gotta update them. Tell them what, what we're doing today. Uh working. Holiday season for retail is like a big deal. Like you gotta be on top of your game with like yep. Black Friday and all the Christmas holiday drops yep. and sales. It's like the time of the year. So we're trying to get a lot of that like organized and prepped. We got door busters and emails going out and all the fun stuff yeah so today we're gonna be filming a bunch of content and like pre-content because we go out of town for thanksgiving normally we're in nashville so we try <laughs> and do all of our work pre yeah and then we'll come back in ready to do packages that's right so lots of preparation for black friday and stuff going on today and then we'll be ready to go you guys you guys be ready come black friday you better buy it before it's gone Right? Something like that. I don't know. That's what people say. I'm pretty sure we're going to have the biggest markdowns this year than we've ever had before. So that's exciting. See? Right? That's right. Let's get to work. Where do I clip it at? Yeah, I'll just. Let me see. Okay, sure. I asked you to do that earlier, and he was like, oh, I can't I don't do it like, on the phone. I don't like editing on the phone. I like editing on the computer. Da, 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 da. Good. It's good. Boom. Yeah. I'm going to split her right there. Yes. Bro. Yeah. Erase. <laughs> I was waiting for it to smile. I'm just trying to focus. <laughs> That's perfect. Thank you, thank you. You're awesome. I appreciate you. Thanks. What did you change? They appreciate me. What's up, my boy? You go sit with us? Hey, yeah. yeah. Hi. Bye. Bye. Ball. You want the ball? Go get it. We're home from the shop. It's honestly the first time we've been outside to like hang out in a while because it's been so cold, but now it warmed up again. It's like the yeah. perfect like breeze, but still hot. Yep. You got it, Bubba? We're in full like swing of the boutique now for the holidays. <laughs> Dude, that's why You're we so it. crazy, huh? Oh my goodness. You're Ow. so big. Last week we mentioned about getting Zade's blood work again um, to check buddy. his levels. And we got a call in that they're looking good. Everything's back yep. on track. His iron and his. He had some high um, levels of lead. Bro. You got an arm. Throw it that way. Can you throw it over throw there? Throw it over there. But those are both evened out and yeah, good again. Yeah, because so the said, lead didn't make doing, sense. Yeah, she said it could be some fluke thing that it was random and now it's yeah. out of his system. Um, but yeah, and then they took him off iron because he was taking iron daily to get those levels up. So now we're just going to make sure we're eating like foods that are rich in iron. That's about it. Are you feeling good? Bird? Bird. Bird. Hey, does your lead levels feel better? Do they feel better now? Oh, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> Peace out, guys. Oh, you want to put it on? Out. Okay, good job. We're actually about to go, so we'll talk more about this later, but we're having to separate for a little bit. Shocker. We never do that these days. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, I'm driving Carlin everywhere. Um, her mom's going to come and help out because I have to go to church mm -hmm. to film something. Layla but, has uh, dance. Yeah, Layla has And I can't ballet. drive her to dance. So, so my mom's going to come drive her to dance. We were actually in a pickle, but... Yeah, we've been in a couple pickles lately. Yeah. <laughs> It's 9.54. <laughs> we are tired. We've had a long week over here. Yeah. We're ready to go to bed. We also have an early morning tomorrow as well. He got told y'all early in the week about uh, Black Friday retail. You gotta be on your game. If you guys have not tried Beam yet, you are missing out. When I say the sleep game changer, I mean it. Do you want this flavor? I'm doing the cinnamon. I'll do peanut butter. Okay. Cinnamon's my favorite. 
the peanut butter is Evans. It's just like a hot cocoa and it's like formulated to help you get the best night's sleep and it does exactly that. <laughs> <laughs> and we're here for it. My struggle isn't once I go to sleep, staying asleep, it's like trying to go to sleep. Like yeah. even if I remove distractions like scrolling my phone and all the things, it's hard for me to like, I toss and turn and my mind goes 100 miles an hour. Yeah. This like flips a switch for me. I don't wake up like groggy or anything like that. Um, it just helps me go to sleep. Mm. Cheers. Mm. So good. They have a couple different versions. If you are curious, they have like a CBD. We use the one that's not the CBD. They have a lot of different flavors. They're actually doing like, there's no code you need for this. It's 50% off. It's like their biggest sale of the year and it's limited time only. Um, you can click a link in our description or there's like a QR code I'll throw up on the screen for you. But I highly recommend it. Like I'm like Carlin. Yes, falling asleep is big for me, but also staying asleep. Like I wake up at these smallest things. So it's huge for me. Like, you know the benefits of getting a full night's sleep when that happens, like you're just ready to go. And this right here is your personal little sleepy time pillow thing. So we'll do free shipping weekend. Yes. Then we pop to Thanksgiving week. And okay. that will be door busters dropping every couple hours. We were thinking Monday through Wednesday and then starting Black Friday, like midday Thursday. Yeah, because a lot that. of people after they had their meal, they're yeah. already ready to start shopping because their their game, their mind is already ready yeah. for yeah. and prepped for Black Friday. The day I'm before? Tempted, I'm tempted to put the email out though on Thursday, like midday. I, I yeah, think, think it people like sat down on their phone after they've Maybe eaten and they're ready or to even shop. Four o'clock, three yeah. o'clock, four o'clock. I'm thinking something like that. Are you gonna end with a big Sour Monday sale? Honestly, think we're gonna play it by ear. I know. I love That's that. how it goes. That's what I love to do. <laughs> do I hear that? It's either a deer or a squirrel, but it's a deer. Dude, Izzy, Izzy hears it too. Look at her go. Izzy, is it a deer? <laughs> yeah, girl, it is. We are soaking up the last few days, as you can tell, of this warm, beautiful weather where it gets cold. But anyways, we just got back from the shop again. So we're here. We're going to chat with y'all about what's new. This week, we've actually been talking a lot about um, Carlin's driving because this is one of the first weeks in a while that it really has made things quite a bit more difficult, to be honest. I just feel like we're starting to have... Like you're starting to have more responsibilities outside the house. Like you're helping with the church a lot. Yeah. And then um, appointments, doctor's appointments and dance and taking the kids places. So I don't know. It's just starting to get a little more complicated with work too. Because I can only go into work if Evan drives me into work. But then we have to get Layla to dance. But then you've been at the church. There's been three or four incidences this week where I'm like, I just wish I could drive. I just literally need to go four miles. And I will say yesterday was helpful because my mom was able to drive up here and then she picked me and Layla up and drove us over literally an exit up the road for her dance class. So it worked out. It's just getting a little more complicated to coordinate everyone's schedules to be able to get the things done that we need to get done. I mean, Yes, it's frustrating. Like the first couple weeks that I couldn't drive, it was like, ah, oh, no big deal. And you started to be home with me and we kind of started doing everything together and it was great. But now that I'm feeling better and things seem to be getting back to normal, not to be able to drive still is getting a little more frustrating. Not to complain, like I'm, I'm grateful that you have been able to help me as much as you have. But you know what I mean? This is just kind of some of our thoughts that we're running through, counting down hopefully when I can drive again so that things can kind of like become a little more normal. What are you thinking? How do you feel about it? I totally agree. Like it's just been different lately because our schedules have, like you said, started to be a little different. I've been trying to do a lot of uh, volunteer work at our church and like little things like that. Like last night I was helping out at church and had to be there at a specific time which was like right in the middle of the ballet class. Yeah. Well, you've also been like shooting footage for friends and things like that and yeah. trying to help out. I guess it's it's good and it's bad. Like, I'm ready to drive. I don't know. <laughs> I think that's, I that's part of it. it. Like, Carlin's always so sweet and she loves to sound like she's not trying to complain because obviously she always says 
people have it way harder than me. Yeah. I think it's getting really annoying and almost hard on her because she does feel better most of the time now. But she can't just drive to like, like last night, I'm at the church all night. She can't drive to just go pick up food or pick up groceries. Like, yeah. she can't leave the house when I'm not to here. Eat, and so then I had to DoorDash. <laughs> so then I DoorDash something for Layla to eat, and the DoorDasher accidentally sent it to the other house. And then they finally went and got it and brought us food to our house. So it was just kind of like common. It sounds. I finally ate super late. It sounds dumb. It sounds like okay. millennial. It sounds like millennials or Gen Z, whatever know, we are, at problems. Least I could DoorDash. Right? <laughs> like, oh, I had to DoorDash. But it is like, it's, it's just getting kind of hard on her like when when I'm out doing stuff and everything so anyways I wouldn't I wouldn't say that it's getting hard I'm just like thinking about it a little bit more does that make sense mm -hmm. because obviously it's on my mind to have to be dependent on everyone else especially when I'm a very independent person but it's good mm -hmm. I'm learning to be dependent on other people that's right very well apparently <laughs> but my sister is coming in town next week so that's actually gonna be really nice because she mm -hmm. can drive um, so you'll be able to do like your stuff, go to work. And she actually was like, hey, I can drive you into work. So it's gonna be a nice next week. So yeah. we're gonna go into work together, but it works. But I definitely am ready for my six months to be up so that I can Ooh, Set that countdown. Again. Yes. Sister, what are you making? You're doing more cookies again? She literally just ignores you. <laughs> She's so focused, she doesn't even like acknowledge our presence. At Maybe me. Layla's gonna be the first like steward in this household to actually want to bake and cook. Yes, that would be awesome. After we did the cookies the other night for Christmas, she like has been loving it. So Adley actually was watching her today while we were yeah. at work and she helped her make from scratch, like yeah. quick, just little sugar cookies. They taste a lot like the yeah. um, homemade like chocolate, chocolate chip, chip cookies ones I do. that you yeah. make. Oh, so good. So Layla's loving it. Okay, I'm putting this here, mm -hmm. and putting this there, mm -hmm. and putting some on and making it. Oh, nice. That's, That's beautiful. Pretty neat. Can you make me a star shape? <laughs> you do know how to do that? Oh my goodness. <laughs> what are you, a queen? A princess. Oh, whoa. Princess Layla. I'm Princess Sissy. Elsa Mermaid. Oh. Layla Sissy Mermaid Elsa. I love all duh, of your names. Layla Sissy Mermaid Elsa. Yeah, duh. <gasps> oh my goodness. Don't mess it up. It's so perfect. You is, did it. Isn't Addie the best for helping you make these? She's so sweet. I'm about to head out for the uh, last night of that project I'm working on at the church. And, uh, be gone most of the night, but I'm trying to almost be late to get one of these sugar cookies. <laughs> you know what she's singing, right? What? The three people says of God. She's talking about the Trinity. Layla, what's the Trinity? What's the three parts of God? God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Ghost. Holy Dude. Spirit. <laughs> she's Holy Spirit and... <laughs> Anyways, Warden joined us. Lunch is amazing. I decided to whip up a fancy little lunch. Delicious. Mm. What are you thinking? It's amazing. We're on a roll today. Layla, school's done. Lunch, I got a house reset and I have two more bills to pay. I've been editing. I mean, we are knocking it out. I worked out. Shocker. It may have only been a 10 minute workout, but... A workout's a workout. That's right. And a two 10 minute workout. So that's 20 minutes. That's double. <laughs> okay, earlier I was in the living room and I saw Layla doing the cutest thing. Harlan gave her a book to sift through and she was picking what she wants for Christmas. Wait, babe. Wait, you gotta find the toy you like and put it by the toy. Whoa. Didn't Layla already put a sticker by something? She picked two. Oh. <gasps> Layla, did okay. you already pick some? Show daddy the ones that you picked. I You love that one? Well, you didn't pick that one. That's an American girl no. book. That? That's not what you picked. She's this picking more. Like this is the problem with kids. You ask them to like tell you something that you think they'll like, you know what they think. Oh, I want and that. then they keep changing. There it is, Lola. <gasps> this is one of her first things she wants right what? now. What? What is it? A flying girl play. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Say what you want, Bubba. You want a car? Do a car or a truck? Yeah? 
I want that one. That pink car? <laughs> you want I the want pink car too? <laughs> <laughs> he just wants us to see you want. I thought I saw Layla picking some really big stuff, like a remote control car thing. And a swing set. Oh. <gasps> Which I hope she gets a swing set. Evan and I were talking and I don't really a have. Swing, yeah, a swing set might be in the... It might be in the works, but we haven't found like a really good one that we like yet. We right. want it to be good quality and also something that we can sell. Because. <laughs> <laughs> it don't matter. I can just get Warden to set up a swing set. Warden, will you come set up as a swing set if we yeah, get that sure. for the kids for Christmas? <laughs> but really, if we do get them a swing set, I want it to be like one that's going to last for like the kids growing oh, up. Um, and a good size. So in other words, if you guys know of a nice brand or something, yeah. let us know. I found one, but they're like way too pricey, so. We're gonna pass on her, but I do need to find one to get it in time. Yeah. And then how would we use that to surprise him though? I know, so maybe even better outside. for like spring or summer. No, we get it now, get it all set up in <laughs> winter time so it's ready for spring. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Layla's still picking what she wants. Mommy, yeah. now can I send the hair? Right here, these <gasps> are the American Girl dolls. You can make them look just like you. You can change their hair and their outfits, and you can get matching outfits with Bo, them. Bo. 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 Well, you go to the store and you pick it out. You have to go to the store. Anyways, let's show Daddy the other thing that you want. Yeah, didn't you circle a big Jeep or something? Look for the sticker. Oh, she already put her sticker right yeah, there. Yeah, we love it. <laughs> Did you forget that you loved it? Yes, I love two pink cars. Yeah. I love that one. Yeah. yeah. What about the American Girl doll? Mom! Yes, I did. Mom. And what Mom. about the playground that you said you put a sticker by? Well, which one do you want the most? The most, the most, the most out of all of them? I want this pink car and a playground. <laughs> oh, Christmas is going to be so much fun this I'm year. Excited. It's like the only thing Mom. on my mind right now. I'm so excited. I I just think it's going to be you so You actually want to go shopping. Maybe we'll go shopping tonight. I don't know. I'm in the Christmas vibes. Like, we've gotten a lot of our work done this week. I'm so proud. It's Friday, and Evan has to, like, edit the vlog and stuff like that. You got a ball on your ball. belly. Where is it? Where's, Where's the ball? ball? Uh, 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 Get it. <laughs> Get it. Uh, here. <laughs> he really struggled. <laughs> There it is! Hey Z, can you tell me where your nose is? Where's your nose? Hong Kong. Where's your belly button? You got your belly button. Hey, belly can you throw button. the ball? Whoa, that was right at my hand. I just can't catch. Good throw, buddy. Good job, Baba. All right, guys, we might go Christmas shopping. We might go knock some things out, but we're gonna get out of here. We love you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Peace. Wow, you ended back like right at the exact spot. That's better than I would do. <laughs>